Hello guys, welcome to chapter 21. Alright, so let's see what the, to the Tao has in store for us today. A man of great virtue is one who follows nature way of Tao. Alright, who is this man of virtue? How can you become a man of virtue? Just follow the way of Tao. Easy math, easy math. This Tao is vague and intangible. Unfortunately for all of us, this Tao is a bit vague and intangible, right? Yet, in the vague and void, there is image, there is substance. Alright, always remember, we talked quite a lot already about this idea of emptiness and nothingness. But let's remember and let us not forget about the substance, about the stuff that is tangible. Think about that. Within the void, there is image, there is substance. Within the profound intangible, there is essence. Mm, essence is an important, important term that we need to remember. Within the profound intangible, there is essence. Alright? Essence. What is essence? Essence is something that's defining an object, right? Defining something. Usually we're talking about abstract terms in that it's hard to explain them. And then we talk about the essence of the thing, which is everything that makes the being what it is. Anyway, we'll see essence coming back again. This essence is genuine. It, in it lies the great faith. Hmm. Well, the essence is genuine and the great faith lies in it. The great faith. The great faith is an interesting term because we already talked about faith in earlier chapter. And now they're talking about the great faith that lies within, within what? Within the essence, which is genuine. All right, you get it? Your faith is within your essence. Your essence is genuine. That's the truth, basically. When we talk about the truth, we are talking about essence. The essence is genuine. Think about it. Since the beginning of the world, Tao has been in existence. We are reminded that Tao has always been and always will be. Only through it, it with a capital I, only through it, that one can understand the origin of all things, of all beings. Only through God, through this essence that is everything, you can uh, understand the origin of all beings. Only through it. That's the creator, basically, the origin. How do I know that this is the true essence? It is through this natural way, again. <laughs> How do you know that all of this is the truth? If the, all of this is the truth and not some sort of illusion created by, I don't know, demonic beings or some negative force or whatever, how come you, don't, you know that it's not all a fake teaching by some uh, evil being or whatever. Well, follow the way. This is the way. This is the path. This is the truth. If you follow natural way, you will, you will go with the essence, with the truth. All right, so that's uh, chapter 21, and we'll continue with the next one.